Hey guys, and welcome back to the next episode of Review It Wednesday. As always, I hope you guys are out there staying safe and healthy. Um, today, I'm going to be reviewing some makeup for you. Um, Beauty Counter is an amazing company, and their uh, main goal is they're advocating for a cleaner future. So all their products are all clean. They're a certified B Corporation. They are a part of a global movement of brands using Business Force for a positive change. They have so many award-winning products um, for safety. Actually, if you go on their website, they have what's called a never list where you can see 1,800 ingredients that they never use. So they are huge on the clean products and you definitely want to check them out. I was introduced to them actually by a mom that I met on Instagram named Cynthia. I'm going to tag her below. So if you want to try any of these products, definitely reach out to her. She's so cool. Um, one of my favorite people that I met on Instagram and yeah, so definitely reach out to her. Um, the first thing I'm going to review for you is it is a eyeshadow palette and it is a velvet eyeshadow palette in Iconic. You can kind of see the different colors there. So if you know me personally, you know that I love funky colors. I kind of usually mix kind of like a, almost like cotton candy colors like um, blue, pink, purple. Or what I do is sometimes I am in the mood to just match my eyeshadow with my clothing. So that's kind of what I did today. Um, and the color that I'm wearing out of this palette today is called Fringe. This one right here. You can see it lasts a very long time. That's one thing I'll say. Um, I'm all about eyeshadows that last. I actually put this on at 7.30 this morning. I went to an eye doctor appointment. They put, um, they dial in my eyes, so they put the drops in my eyes, and I still have my makeup on. So that is a huge plus for me uh, when it comes to eyeshadow. Some of the other colors are Chiffon, Bangle, Feather, Sequin, Ribbon, Stiletto, Pendant, and Lace. And I'm going to kind of try to show you real quick what these colors actually look like. Like I said, the one that I'm wearing right here is called Fringe. The next one is called Chiffon. It's kind of like a brownish gold color. Bangle. It's a little bit lighter, and these lines are not going to be straight, so don't mind me. But that's kind of like a gold, gold color. The next one is called Feather. It's kind of a brown, um, dark brown color. You can see that. I'm going to focus. Sequin, this one is I've used a bunch of times already actually, and it's kind of um, a glittery color. I put it on over some of my other colors because it's very light, but you can kind of see it's got that glitter effect to it. Then the next one is kind of a lighter brown. That one's ribbon. You can see right there. And the next one is kind of um, a silver color which I also love to wear silver if um, I'm trying to do like a smoky eye. And this one works great for that. So let me show you. You can kind of see that silvery look again. Sorry, I seem to be going down a path. <laughs> um, the next one is called Pendant. And it looks like it's going to be kind of a greenish color. Kind of like a greenish gold and then the last one it's kind of a light pink color called lace this one right here and what I tend to do myself is if I'm doing like a mixture of colors I'll get a color like this um, like maybe a light pink or white and I'll kind of use that to go over it to just soften the colors and kind of blend them together so this right here you can see these are all see I'm trying to focus it these are all the different colors on this palette and it's fun to mix them together like I said they last a long time um, which is a great selling point for me uh, when I look for eyeshadow and any kind of eye makeup I want it to last all day uh, and another um, tip that I do is when I'm putting on my eyeshadow I'll either use a primer or a lotion but if you use lotion, make sure you be careful not to get it in your eye itself. And I'll put that on um, my eyelid before I put the eyeshadow on and wait like maybe 10, 15 seconds for it to dry. And then that then put my eyeshadow on and that helps it last all day as well. So that's just a little uh, trick that I learned over the years. But these are all the pretty colors. And then I also got an eyeliner. 
So the eyeliner is what I'm wearing now also. I'm not the best at cat eyes or anything like that, but this eyeliner, it has a very thin brush, so it makes it easy to um, line your upper lids. So it's got a very thin brush. I'm going to show you that it's very dark. It's very easy to use. Like I said, I'm not an expert on eyeliner, but I love the thin brush and I need the liquid eyeliner. Um, their mission is to get safer products into the hands of everyone when formulating their products. They prohibit the use of over uh, 1,500 harmful or questionable ingredients, which now it's gone to 1,800. So again, this is from a company called Beauty Counter. And if you are interested in learning more about them, check out their website and also reach out to Cynthia, who I tagged below, um, to learn more about this amazing company and their awesome makeup products. As always, thank you for watching Review It Wednesday. And if you have any products that you would like me to review, please feel free to DM me or email me at thezampcamp at gmail.com. And again, thank you for watching. It means the world to me. Have a great day and peace.